I'm continuing on the Cloud Control 13C setup video. Uh, today we're on the step 10 setup notification. Before we did installation configuration for 13C, and then we already established the monitoring targets. If the targets something goes wrong, it can send the message to the people like DBAs directly. So DBA can take care of it. In order to do this, the notification needed to be set up. In the notification setup, there's two things you have to do. One is article email, mail server setup. Because this mail is from Linux or Unix sent out through the rally mail, mail rally server. And then the second one is who is a receiver. Basically, it's a pretty simple. This is really short video, take you probably only five minutes. Owner for this task when allowing allowing us DBA say you remember super user we created, right? I'm not using the sysman. So when you log in, you see the page, you click on the setup, notification, mail server. When you click on the mail server, you got next page. There's a small window on it. Two things, sender. You can put anything there, A, B, C, D, E, doesn't matter. The sender's email address. That one, you cannot uh, put the fake one. This one has to be set up by network people or OS team. When they set up this one, they gave you the outgoing email, sender's email. You put here, click on OK. When you click on OK, the next window you can get is outgoing the mail at PMB server, right? They ask you, what is the SMTP outgoing mail server? The Unix, Linux, and generally using SMTP server to send mail from server side to outside world, like a outside email address. So usually through the one called the Ready Server, R E L A Y dot domain dot com or university.edu, something like that. And then in order to end it, you click on here, end. When you click on end, you got one small window. This window basically asks you two things. One, ready server, R-E-L-A-Y dot domain dot com or university.edu. Port, it is usually it is 25. Usually it's 25. You click on OK. When you click on OK, you got confirmation that is successfully right the next one because you already have set outgoing mail you have to set up receiver who's going to receive it doing this go to setup again select enterprise manager password email the next window this window is the First part, you do not care. This is a DBA user, super user setup. If you want to change the password, you can do it here. But now we try to set up an email address. The email address is the receiver's email address. You raise the DBA, receive these emails. To do so, click on end another row. And then you put one email. And another row, you put on another one. Continue to mind how many DBs in your group you put in all of them. This is just set up. That's that's not really meaning those people will get the email anytime. Uh, later, you can configure it. Who is getting it uh, in what time? Say, on Monday, who is getting it? Uh, weekend, who is getting it? Night, who is getting it uh, from uh, in the morning? Eight, to five who's getting it after five who's getting it so it's just to give you the information say 
email can be sent to those people. Basically, by now, you set up notification, two things already done, outgoing mail, server, and then who is the receiver. That's it for today. So thanks for listening. See you next time. Bye.